We're here today at NOAA, the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration, to learn more about this organization that uses science to keep us informed about weather, severe storms, and climate. My name is Tom LaFay, meteorologist here at the Earth Systems Research Lab. As I told you, I was interested in science all throughout school and knew I wanted to go into some sort of science. When I got into high school, I realized that the only school in California that taught meteorology, the study of weather, was San Jose State University. So I went to San Jose State. And the day I arrived, they told me I'd have to go three more years to San Jose State, and I was planning on two of them, which was very disappointing. So I went ahead and took my first semester, and my second semester, and then by the third semester, um, I realized some of my friends that were in the meteorology department with me were going off to Boulder for the summer to work at a lab, a lab where they do real science and weather research, to come out here for summer internships. So I worked here a summer and a fall in 1980 and then went back to school. I worked a, a spring and a summer the following year and went back to school and finished up my degree. And then I came back here and they converted me to a full-time employee. So the internship that I got when I was a student turned into a full-time job and finally a career because I've been since that time. I started here in 1980 and now it's two years. Typically, I'll come into work, I'll do some computer programming, I'll meet with my colleagues or forecasters uh, to talk about the requirements of the things that the computer program should do, and, uh, and then go back to the writing more computer programs. The work that I do benefits everybody, the whole country. What I do is write computer software that helps forecasters do a better job of forecasting the weather and helps them warn the public. So I consider what I do helping keep people safe and free from risk. Well, NOAA has a lot to do with the fire. There are several parts of NOAA that affect happening with that fire. The first is some of the work that we do. Uh, building computer systems that allow forecasters to see and visualize data a lot better than the, the weather service forecasters who work for NOAA provide forecasts to what's called fire bosses that manage the fire and manage the firefighters when they're fighting that fire. So those bosses talk to the weather service forecasters to get an idea of how best to attack the fire and keep the firefighters safe.